हेलो एवरी वन दिस इज अवर टाइप वन एल एफ एस आर टाइप वन बिकॉज ऑफ दिस इज एक्सटर्नल लिनियर फीडबैक सिप रजिस्टर इन दिस वी कैन सी दैट अवर आउटपुट बुट इज अ थ्री बिट एंड आफ्टर बिकॉज ऑफ द प्रिमेटिव पोलिन मिल्स दिस वन आउटपुट टू एंड आउटपुट वन वी हैव एक्सरिंग दैट आउटपुट एंड फीडेड टू अवर इनपुट साइड so that's why uh, because of the this uh, primitive polynomials uh, it will uh, give maximum 2 raised to n minus 1 so that's why it will give uh, seven input combination so uh, so that's and uh, we have initialized uh, our output with 100 so uh, that's why after uh, after 11 100 it will uh, repeat uh, this sequence based on the uh, lfsr sequence and uh, we have implement uh, this uh, lfsr in Zilinx Spartan 3 kit. Uh, this is our uh, Zilinx Spartan 3 kit. Uh, here we can see that uh, uh, we have a output as a 3 bit output. So this is the output. Uh, this is the uh, uh, output two. This is output one, and this is output zero. So this is a 3 bit output. and we have initialized this uh, toggle switch uh, as a clock uh, this toggle switch as a enable and this toggle switch as a reset pin so if we reset if if we enable uh, if we, if we uh, enable this reset pin so it will reset our all the state and in in the next clock uh, uh, edge positive edge it will de detect this reset and it will uh, reset our output as a 000 so after 000 uh, uh, after 000 output it will uh, stuck into that uh, in, into that state and uh, uh, our lfsr won't work so uh, we will uh, keep keep this as a uh, zero reset and we will enable uh, we will enable this as a one and this is our clock so that's why after every uh, after every positive edge it will detect uh, detect our output and this is output 2 and output 0 so because of the primitive polynomial uh, this uh, two output 0 and output 1 will be xoring and feeded to our input side and this output 2 and output 1 will be shifted right by one bit so after uh, the uh, next uh, positive edge it will detect our 100 so 100 will be 10 uh, will be xoring uh, will be 1 so that's why it will be feeded to 1 and this 10 will be shifted to right side so our output will be 110 so in the next positive edge triggered it will uh, detect uh, this 110 and this 10 will be xored xor uh, xoring will be 1 and it will feeded to uh, input side 1 and this 21 will be uh, shifted right to uh, shifted right by 1 bit so our output will be 111 okay so now our output is uh, 111 so after every uh, every positive edge trigger it will detect our output and it will xor this output to an output 0 and uh, fed it to input side so that's why our lfsr sequence will be uh, run to the 7 uh, uh, times and after 7 7 sequence it will repeat its uh, sequence by 100 so we can see that okay this is our 011 This is one zero one. This is zero uh zero one zero, and this is zero zero one, and this is our uh, original initial one zero zero sequence. So after uh, seven clock, it will repeat our uh, LFSR sequence because this is three bit LFSR. So we have implement uh, this uh, our project in Xilinx Spartan three kit. and we have already uh, we have all uh, we have also simulate our uh, xilinx lfsr code in our uh, icin simulator so we can see that the our uh, first initial uh, our our first initial uh, uh, initial output as a 100 and after that our next output is a 110 One 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 zero one 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 zero one zero one zero zero one zero zero one and one zero zero. This is our initial output. So we can see that here our output sequence is a seven output sequence. And after this seven output sequence, it will repeat our uh, sequence as this uh, uh, L, uh, three bit LFSR. So uh, we can see that the our uh, ICM simulator and Xilinx Spartan circuit our output is verified. Thank you.